Animal shelters across the country are providing some much needed positivity during the coronavirus outbreak. Shelters that were once packed full of animals are now empty due to an increase of adoptions and fosterings during shelter in place orders around the US. Some local Philadelphia shelters spoke to us on what their experiences are like during these unprecedented times. We have three locations. Um, and our location in the Northeast, our adoption center in the Northeast, and our adoption center at Second and Arch are actually currently closed. Um, and the reason is lack of animals. People are really, they're really coming out strong and taking animals home, uh, both in foster and adoptive homes. In mid-March, we had put out a call to the public saying that we needed fosters and adopters, and we had over 1,200 people, brand new people, um, sign up to be fosters in a two-week period. The increase in adoption and fostering applications have given the staff at both PAWS and ACT Philly work to do remotely. The benefit of technology is that people are still able to apply and it's both for foster and for adoptive for adopting it's easy for us to be able to then process those applications we can call people we can follow up online that kind of thing elena khan a university of maryland baltimore student recently adopted a new furry friend named mojo khan and her partner thought now was the perfect time to adopt the dog they've always wanted we were actually planning or hoping to adopt over the summer um once i finished school and we had a little more time um but then this came up and we're home all the time, so it seems like the perfect time to help somebody adjust, supervise and make sure potty training is going well and get all that figured out before we go back to work. Gives us a good reason to like go outside, like we're taking a lot more walks and stuff, um, which I think is good for us too. While a new dog or cat could cure your loneliness during self-isolation, shelters recommend considering your life normally and deciding if adopting or fostering would be better for your lifestyle. Most people have a ton of time right now. Um, you know, you see all over social media, everybody's working out, everybody is like, you know, doing these really um, creative things and, and that's great. Um, but if that's not how your life is normally, you know, maybe adopting a dog that needs a five mile run every day isn't the best fit. Um, I think having that awareness is important, but I wouldn't let it stop anybody like, oh, I have a full-time job normally, I can't adopt an animal, you, you can, you know, it's just finding the right one. Both PAWS and ACT Philly still have plenty of animals that are looking to be adopted or fostered. And if you're not in the Philadelphia area, check out your local shelter's website to find your new quarantine companion. This has been Kira Sobel reporting for The Temp.